Ever wondered if you could create video heroes in Hostinger Website Builder? Well, now you can, albeit with a not insignificant caveat. Today I'm going to walk you through how to create a hero section with a video background using the Hostinger Website Builder. Hostinger has really stepped up its game recently. For projects on a tight budget, it's a brilliant option. And in some ways, it's getting closer to platforms like Squarespace. So what exactly is a video hero? It's that bold section at the top of a site with a video playing in the background designed to grab attention straight away. When done well, it can make your website look professional and engaging, but, and this is the important bit, they're not right for every project. I'll show you where they can really shine and when it's better to go for a simpler approach. We'll also take a quick look at how to add one in hosting as builder and tweak it to suit your style. Right, let's crack on. Here's an example of a hero section with a video background. As I mentioned in the intro to this video, we can set it up, but there is a caveat to keep in mind. At present, we can only use stock videos within this platform. Before we explore that further, let's delete the existing hero section and start fresh. This is just a demo site I've set up using the Hostinger website builder. Nothing else here needs your attention for now. I'll add a new section by clicking add section. From here, we have a range of preset designs to choose from. I could pick something completely different, but I really like this option with the glassy overlay. Hostinger has been making impressive upgrades to their platform behind the scenes. While it's not quite on par with Squarespace or Wix yet, it's closing the gap, especially in terms of more polished high-end designs. If we wanted to enhance this further, we could add more white space, both macro and micro. Macro white space refers to the space around the section, while micro white space is the spacing between individual elements like text and buttons. Once we've done that, we can move on to editing the section. Although I like the gradient backdrop, I'll switch it to a video instead. You'll find the video option in the toolbar on the right. That's essentially how you can add a video background. You might not love the default shot or the overlay, but we can tweak those settings. While it's possible to change the overlay in platforms like Squarespace, where you can customize the color or make the backdrop fixed, the current options here are a bit limited. If you enable the parallax effect, the content slides over the video, creating a more dynamic look without affecting load time. The main limitation, as I mentioned earlier, is that we can only use the free stock videos available on the platform. While there are a few to choose from, this won't suit everyone. If you have a niche offering, like showcasing a holiday destination with specific footage, a video hero section may not meet your needs. At Pixel Haze, my team and I are looking into creating a plugin to work around this, potentially allowing users to inject their own videos from sources like Vimeo. For now, though, we're limited to the stock options, which can still serve as a decent backdrop. Thanks to Hostinger for adding this feature. While it's not perfect yet, I'll give credit where it's due. Their development and product teams are excellent at incorporating user requests into their roadmap. I'll revisit this platform in 2025 to provide more tutorials and tips to help you make the most of it. If you need extra support, check out pixelhaze.academy, where we offer a free membership. If you're ready to go further, we have two communities on the school platform. That's school with a K, S-K-O-O-L. In these communities, you can either access peer support or join our coaching group, where we run up to five live sessions per week. These are great opportunities to share challenges, whether you're a professional designer or a business owner building your site. I hope you found this helpful, and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.